So, Navigator Leader. First mate has served several ships and experienced dangerous quests. Be aware, his desire for reputation may alter the city's fate. Okay. Whenever you redraw, minus five seconds redraw cooldown for every discarded card. Oh. And plus one per leader level stocked all cards in hand. Curious about how that works. Let's go coast because that seems very apropos for him. Rocks appear at your territory, delaying your constructions. Let's give it a shot. I'm not necessarily sure how much I care about the pollution levels. Maybe they're okay. <laughs> I'll get on my town hall. One second. Uh, my town hall is straight up just a boat. Oh, Pop Potter. Okay, I've got plenty of plenty of space. So I gotta I gotta take a look at this. Notoriety. Card cost is increased by the amount of accumulated notoriety. After 15 seconds, gain gold. Okay. So we'll want to get rid of pillage, but for now it's at least kind of good. Stock 7. Cards spend a single stock when played. Cards with zero stock are unplayable. Oh, so the deckhands... The deckhands are superior units, but I have a limited number of uses on them. That makes sense. Pop Potter, pop cheese. Let's just boost stock on that guy, seeing as he's the only one that I have. Okay, pop the deckhand down. Aw, he's cute. Okay, pop ch potter, cheese, grain. He should be solid enough to handle this on his own. But we'll get a second one just for convenience sake. Okay, not enough radisons for pillage. Yeah, we'll inevitably want to get rid of it. But not right now. Okay, so blessing. I could reduce, permanently reduce the cost of pillage so I could use it more. It's not that useful. Let's go for the houses. House, potter, pillage. As soon as the house is done, we get grain. Bang. There's the merchant. I've got a decent amount of money. We want to grab... Breed. Defensive wall, market. For every, every 30 seconds, increase, permanent increase to, okay, that's way too good. Pop the cheese, grab the house. Okay, breed. So missionary, missionary is a permanent buffer. What I'd like to do is get the mi missionary on like ranged units. But we'll see what I can do. Get the house down. Get the market down. Get another deck hand down. Potter, cheese, cheese, and breed. Getting breed this early is amazing. So, between two similar games, which do you like better? This or Kingdom Two Crowns? Probably this one. Kingdom Two Crowns is incredibly long. Let's get a blessing card. In retrospect, at least making Potter cheaper would be worth it. Okay, I'll get one missionary, and then we're gonna want to look at the other side because oh dang, they're coming this way now. Uh, you know what? Let's make breed cheaper. No, 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 no. We'll make Potter cheaper first. Okay, get a guard down. Get a deck hand down. Okay, get an advisor. We get whenever you redraw, keep all skill cards in hand, which is really good. Pop Potter. Pop 
Pop breed. No more pillage. Maybe if I'm having an okay time of it. But I'm not. We're gonna need some doctors here. Random military card, random building card. Get a fishery. You know, I'll take a I'll take a fishery on this one. Okay, we could gain fire station, pillage, or paddling. Draw some cards. Nah. Let's just remove guards. Or grain. Let's get rid of grain. I got 16 seconds. I'm going to wait. That way I can actually do the supply. So what's Navigator Special? Add stock to cards. So effectively means I can... Uh, these have a limited amount of stock before they just run out. Which is interesting. Uh, let's see. Wharf. 80 gold whenever you redraw. Minus one cards when you re redraw. Bonus Neurodoriety when deployed. Max HP equal to 50% of current Notoroid. Plus max HP equal to Notoriety. Interesting. That makes them expensive, but scaling tanks. I'm going to go for the wharf. I think we need the money. Pop pillage. Okay, remove a card. Leader level lose half my gold. 100%. Go for the blessing, go for a house. Let's go for the blessing. Pop grain. Cycle these. Okay, blessing. I'm going to bless breed. I'm very poor. What do you have for me? Discard a card plus three stock to discard a card. Okay, so reload plus box could work. Discard one card, labor after 20 seconds, plus two gold for every notoriety from discarded cards. So reload would be a very good way to get stock back. I think I'm going to go for a rest, actually. Let's go for a rest. Because that means I don't need to get rid of pillage. Okay. So the big issue is I'm poor as dirt. Okay. Let's just do that one. I guess it's not that great. Ooh. The deckhands are taking some hits. Okay, do we get another blessing? Yeah, I'll get another blessing. We'll pop Potter here. We might want to get some more skill cards, too. Now I'm thinking about it. Anyway. I'm going to get the wharf down. 
because that'll offset some of my finan financial issues. Uh, let's see. Increase the potential gold gain on that. Okay. Smithy. Whoa. I gotta go for this smithy. Which I realize is just gonna involve me sitting around. Until these guys are dead. Uh, you know what? If I boost these two, that's at least something. I'm gonna have to get the deck down. Deck hand down. Okay, we can get the, we can get the smithy at the very least. I'd like to get the market, but I don't need it that bad. Pillage. Luckily, they're attacking the other side. Breed. Ironclad. Okay, and they're attacking the other side. Popper breed, porter. No grain. That was a little too fast for me. Okay. Pop another pillage. Pop another deckhand. Cheese. In, in retrospect, I think the wharf was a trap. Potter, missionary, deckhand. Okay. Read more. Brain more. Treasure chest has appeared. Cool. Do we get the... Blessing. We get a house. We get money. Let's go blessing. Pop pillage. Pop a blessing. Let's get... So here's the thing. I can reduce the cost of pillage. Because that doesn't reduce the notoriety. Okay. Rum, deckhands. I don't think we need rum. I don't think we need the box. Supply supply depot might be good. Budgeting. Orange. Heal target group. Cool. Merchant has arrived. Marine missionary. Other pillage. Just gonna get these two. Shipbuilding. That could work out for me. Nothing I can do. <laughs> I gotta cycle these. Pop Potter. Pop that. Get another missionary, which is not what I want. of that. Yeah, I, I think I've lost. No, we're not dead yet. <laughs> right. Because my missionaries are kind of helping them. Okay, let's remove. We gotta get rid of these cheeses. They're holding me back so bad. A smithy. If I upgrade, it won't work. I I think we're just gonna have to 
reboot this one to some degree. Because I, I wasn't using my stocks very well. And I, I should have. Let's go for the mis missionary level 2. Yeah, discarding the guards really hurts. You're not wrong on that one. But it's it's fine. Like, I'm, I'm going to hold on and try and win this one as best as I possibly can. I'll inevitably lose. Okay, stock five, discard a card. Change the discarded card into a random, common to rare skill card from another leader. Okay. Go for that. Get another blessing. No. We gotta remove these cheeses. Okay. Arrest. Pillage. Get another missionary down. Okay. Fishery is available. I have money. We get a public bath, which is incredible. And I get a pirate. Which is kind of what we were looking for. Pop the pillage. Cycle that. Boost that. We get a pirate down. We get another missionary down. Potter. Breed. Observer ship. Rescue. Plus Radizen, get a danger card. Okay, let's cycle that out. Rummage. Soul Siphon. Didn't really help. Discard him. No notoriety. Still no deckhands. Cargo ship gets me maybe a thing. Okay, bring them back. Read. What is this? I forget which one this is. I'm gonna do missionary. This is the one that gets me stock back. Okay. Get our other pirate. Observer ship. Discard that. Smithy is available. Cool. I may yet make this work. Because at the very least, I'm going to have some really beefy pirates. Okay, that one's completely useless to me. Yeah, I just spam my deck full, and these guys just died too fast. Nope, I don't got this. I, I should have gone for the pirates earlier. Now that I understand how this, this faction works... I might be able to get it working. Okay. Go for the clown. Upgrade. Reroll. Move forward. Yeah, I just I don't have any ranged units. Didn't get any. There's the guild office. Claw machine minigame. I get money. Cool. Pause. We get that. We get rope ridge. Okay. 
I'll get that down, but... Like, where are my units? Where'd they all go? I have no idea. Ugh. Yeah, did my zero stock cards go away? Or... Oh, I changed my other... It's fine. It's... It's okay. This guy is weird. If I give up... I think I just lose here. I could maybe... Wait. Pfft. There goes the clown. I still get the points. I still get the unlock. That's really all that matters right now. Okay. Stock one... After 40 seconds, get a random quest card. Bard. Support plus one attack to adjacent allies for every quest card you've obtained. And plus two cards whenever you discard a quest card. Yeah, let's let's give the navigator another shot. And we'll we'll stick on the coast just because. Because now that I understand how stock works and how to like work around it and not get that one wharf, I think I'll be in a better position than I was. Probably. Let's get the house down. We got plenty of money. Because, yeah, originally I was a little tepid on using uh, pillage. Because it didn't seem like it was worth it for me. It's super worth it. Okay. One thing I've noticed is they've spammed the deck a little bit fuller. Than it used to be. Okay. Just in time. Yeah, now I got quest cards, which is actually super huge. I'll get a guard down. And hopefully I can get some leader levels. Also, do not discount the fishery. It turns out it actually has some of the better cards. I was originally kind of tepid on, on the idea of them just because it's like, ah, eh, it's more spam. Who needs it? And the answer is, I do, actually. Now let's grab a blessing and a guard. And yeah, do not get rid of the guard until I actually have somebody better. Because <laughs> that was hurting me a little bit. Yeah, never discount RNG. Yeah, RNG really wanted me to have other stuff. So... Discard one card, reduce notoriety to discarded cards. Interesting, but not what I'm looking for. I think we're just going to go for the defensive wall. Which is admittedly not the greatest. I was hoping for a better, better set than that. Well, reduced economic cards. That's good. I wish Notoriety was a global set instead of per card. Oh, that would be interesting. Then then I'd be a lot more focused on managing it. Oh, shoot. Ah, oh, and we even had Breed at the start of the last run. It, honestly, this is going to be harder for me, not easier. And yeah, we might want to use some of those spare blessings. Uh, let's see, what can I get? Wharf Orange. No. Leader level up for more stock or blessing. Let's go leader level up. Because being able to restock my dudes is going to be really important. Otherwise, I'm going to be perpetually kind of in trouble. I also need more houses. Holy shit, I need more houses. Potter cheese. Can't pillage. Just don't have the people for it. Probably want to get rid of grain when I can. Oh, we even had the ironclad last round. Gosh. Well, alas. 
Now I know better. Random military card? No. Random advisor. We get this guy. Which is actually really good. I hate going for the house when the other things would be better, but if I can't get people down, we're in trouble. I think losing Breed is the most painful part of this round compared to last year. Yep. Breed is incredibly good. Well. At least I got tons of money, so whenever they come by, I can buy more stuff. Boost up deckhands. This way we'll actually have a good stock of it. Keep pillage rolling. Because I want the notoriety to be high. I'm going to go for remove a card. We're going to get rid of grain. Okay, go for a house, go for a leader level. Keep building houses. Because that way I can keep pillaging. There's the merchant coming in. Please bring me everything I could possibly want and more. Well, there's the market. Arguably, market is the only thing that really matters. Uh, but let's also grab reload. Just so I can get endless deckhands. I think everything else I can live without. I guess ambush could be kind of good. Oh. Give him some more stock. Okay, potter, yes. Mainly market. There's two reasons why I want Reload. Because it decreases my redraw. Whoops. Start with that. Let's chuck him there. Okay. A flat extra deckhands might not be the worst idea. Nah, I just run out pretty quick. Because here's the thing. That's why I got Reload. Leaders, more houses. The thing is, I don't actually need more... Did they make houses worse? They might have. Claw minigame. Bam. Hey! Permanent minus 10 cost to a card whenever its stock reaches zero. Oh. Oh. That's interesting. So, in that case, then you kind of want it to go down, but only for certain cards. But yeah, I can reload the deckhand as it stands. I don't th I don't think I'm going to use up the deckhand stock, just because I'm not going to be using the deckhand that much. But that could be really useful for other economic cards. Oh, there they go. Boy, that sucks. Stock 17. Well, I think I can start putting more of those guys down. Alright. Gotta go for the commander. That'll solve a lot of problems. And now the, those guys aren't terrible. Get rid of cheese. Nine seconds. Okay. Hopefully the market has something amazing in it for me. Get another deckhands down. Get another guards down. Pillage more. Potter. Man, 
Hand Gunner. Stock 5, slow attack speed, when deployed, 3% attack speed for every stock. Oh. Okay. That's slightly different. It's actually incredible. And, oh, there was a rest. Oh man, free boxes. Like, you think it would be good, but it's not actually that amazing. Redraw minus one. Oh, I see. I gotta discard a lot more. Okay. Go for the blessing. Let's see what card I could get. Black market. Way too good not to just get. Okay, grab those. Got a quest. Quest is upgrade a random character. You know what? That's fine. Potter cheese black market. Okay, Merchant is here, as a Monastery, which is good. Let's grab a Rest. And a Defensive Wall. Monastery down. We want to get rid of the Cheeses. Ah, this is... Objectly terrible. Okay. That's got eight. Let's boost that. I'm gonna get a hand gunner down. Deck hand down. And that. And keep pillaging. We might want to use some blessings on pillage, just get the nor notoriety insanely high. Okay. So Supply Depot? Yeah. We got three, we got five. And we're going to want to start losing the cheeses. Because at this point, I've got enough funds from other things. I don't think we need them. But there. That going. Yeah, we're going to need more people. We're going to need a lot more people. Ugh. Because, yeah, I, des I desperately needed breed, and we've lost it. Smuggle. 20 notoriety when played. Labor after 30 seconds, get a random common to rare card from other leaders. Could be amazing, could be complete garbage. Let's just get a second market. Baseline, more markets means more houses. Oh. Rock, useless. Oh, that's what rocks do. Okay. Advisor, lose half my gold? Sure. Get a card. Cheese market? Mm. Budgeting? Yes. Budgeting is easy money. How are we looking on that? Not as useful. That's okay. Yeah, the reason... The reason why I'm not immediately just laying down all these hand gunners, even though they'd actually be quite useful. Okay, what can we get here? We can get one thing. Okay, so soul probably isn't that helpful. 
Oh. Oh, dear sweet gosh. The black market is atrocious. Okay, I'll just get a handgunner there. How to go for the flood cards. Luckily, I got the money for it. Okay. I'm going to start removing the cheeses. Oh, the, the gunners are actually a, a frontliner. Flood, flood. Good to know on that one. Okay. Reduce leader ability cooldown. So territory expansion would give me more people. This would let me stock up more. Upgrade one card. I gotta go for that. That's too good if I can actually get it to work. The big issue is just that I have very specific card combos that I literally have not been able to use. Which is just frustrating. Nope, that doesn't help me. I'll just wait for a second, sock these guys up. Okay, market is available. Oh. Okay. Now the question is, do we go for the smithy? As well. Cost me almost all of my money. I'm gonna do it. Next immediate problem, we have... We have no population to squander on this. At least my dudes are pretty decent, so it's not so bad. Okay, I can at least pillage. Give me that house. Okay, between the Warrens and the markets, we might actually, we might be able to pull this out. Okay, pop that there. Pop the potter. We get a monastery available. We're going to remove the next cheese. Cheese actually probably would have been kind of helpful here, but... Alright. Arrest. Pillage. Budgeting. We get another deckhand, but I'm, I'm going to just rely on my dudes for a bit. As I gotta get these warrens down. Should have started with budgeting. But yeah, between the warrens and the smithy, we'll be in a very good spot. Okay. I'm gonna get another handgunner down. All right, so far so good. Do we get a blessing? Yes. I'll make something cheaper. Question is, no, 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 no. We're gonna get the blessing on. There's a couple I could get it on. It'd be most amazing to some lesser degree on pillage. But I think I'm going to use it on reload. Okay. 
Because honestly, I can I can use pillage at cost. Okay, how you doing? Bad. Okay, budgeting ain't gonna help me. Reload or arrest. I'm just gonna reload the cheese. Don't ask. Alright, there we go. Budgeting gets me some money. That. This looks like a boss. We need some gunners. Guards, deckhands, pillage. Take a look at this. What else can I get? Expedition. Stock one, labor after 40 seconds, get a random quest card. There we go. Dicier than I wanted it to be, but fine. Okay, do we go for expansion? Do we upgrade a card? Let's see what legendary cards I could get. It's got to be public bath. Okay, let's get rid of the last cheese. Okay. Beef that up. Discard that. Expedition or public bath? <laughs> Pop the potter. Budgeting is not going to help me. Arrest ain't going to help me. None of this is going to help me. What do you got? Oh, there's the missionary that would have been amazing. Okay, so we've kind of kidnapped him. I think I'm just going to get the missionary. <laughs> and he's gone. Okay. Deckhand's there. He's attacking on this side. Pop the potter. Reload the missionary. I really wanna... Eh, it's fine. There's the hand gunner. There's a number of things, actually. Okay, reduce my redraw time. Yes. Okay, good. Go for leader level up? Yes. Maybe I should have gone for money. I don't know. Let's go on a random quest. I ran a military skill or economy advisor. Military advisor. Is good. Just go for rum. I'm just gonna go for rum. I should be able to make this back. We definitely gotta get this smithy down. The handgunners seem pretty powerful the more I see them in action, especially if I can pair them with missionaries. Deckhand. Monastery is available. Let's get rid of something garbage. I'm gonna get rid of the guards. Okay, supply depot is available. We're just gonna 
I'm going to keep using it on the handgunners. Eventually we'll run out, but if I can get them up to like 200%, they become obscene. Treasure map. Get gold, get a philosopher's stone card. That sounds really good. Get a blessing. Uh, let's see. Pop that. Reload the smithy. Oh, I could have actually used the smithy. Oh, it's fine. Pop the blessing. Blessing on... I'm thinking budgeting. That way it becomes more economically viable to use. Okay. Oh, I... I had my leader ability. It's fine. Warren is available, which means I can boost my pillage. Frustratingly enough, I literally have not had a rest and pillage at the same time in a long time. Let's grab the fishery. That, that has had actually surprisingly useful benefits. Okay. Well, there's the fishery. And jam it anywhere else? There. Budgeting for money. Okay, here's a problem. No, let's not spend the money on that. Back you go. Arrest, pillage, there we go. Oh, they're literally yoinking my dudes. Rest in peace this run. We were getting it. I understood what I was doing, but we had massive population problems. And then the boss just shows up. Yeah, not being able to build up the early population room this run. Kind of, yeah. I think also just uh, somewhat lack of money. And somewhat just really bad luck. I still feel like the forest is probably the uh, the easiest. Map by far. Yeah, gold problem slowed it down too. Yeah, there were a number of things. You should have sent right side left. <laughs> that is useless, dude. Do you know how slow the rats go? They would have made it there never. And the other wave would have shown up and ripped it to shreds. It... <laughs> that literally has never helped. I've tried in the past. I also don't need advice like that, because it's super meaningless.